The All Blacks are in Chicago and on their way to their northern tour. I quite like when they go to Chicago. It seems to be what's happened two years in a row now. It feels like Chicago is kind of our um, North American stop as we head off to the UK. I quite like that. It seems to be coming uh, a very nice, small routine that the All Blacks are getting into. Of course, in Chicago at the moment, there's a lot going on with the Cubs being in the World Series and the Bulls starting a new season again, and it's that they're still making waves. So what we thought we'd do to start off with real quickly, in case you're unaware, is just show you the itinerary for the next four weeks for the All Blacks. Uh, as you can see, uh, Q28 there, it's got them playing in Chicago this weekend. These are New Zealand times, 9 a.m. Uh, playing in Rome the following weekend, uh, 3 a.m. New Zealand time. That's a Sunday morning. Dublin, 8.30 a.m. Was it 6.30? I can't read it. 6.30. 6.30. And then Paris at 9 a.m. So the next four weekends, we've got AB games on. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, mm. I, it's pretty exciting. I, There's I, only I, one mice guy in that one. The is there? The, the rest of them are probably live. Right, yeah. excellent. I do like the idea of them being in Chicago. I don't know, it just feels... Yeah, it's good. It feels that we've got a place to go now. It like, kind of feels like little little yeah. New Zealand in America is now Chicago. Well, it was really cool to see them. Um, there was a group of them, Kieran Reid and a few others, they were on the big screen at the Chicago Bulls game, you know, packed out Chicago Bulls Stadium, and they were in there. Do they know who they were? Did the crowd know uh, who yeah, they well, were? Yeah, well, they, they, it was announced who, who oh, they cool. were. So, but, yeah, but that brand is actually starting to get quite prominent, All Blacks, you yeah. know. Yeah, because I, I travel quite a lot, and yeah. I was in Chicago. Chicago this year, and people do go, oh, the All Blacks. Oh, yeah, New you Zealand. Know, that's probably because they were, they were coming. All Blacks, yeah, because yeah. uh, well, but no, I think it's it is a global thing that people right. so, people yeah. know Lord of the Rings and rugby. Now I've heard and reports sheep. of that exactly, and yeah. you would think at the moment that the All Blacks wouldn't be making a heck of a lot of waves, given as you say the World Series is on, the Cubs, you know, the Goat, 1908, all of that. But um, apparently, uh, they are still. Um, it, the people are aware that they're in town. They may not know a lot about them, but mm. they know the brand All Blacks. I just hope that they're careful because I was on the street checking my phone. Brexit was happening. I was going, yeah. what is happening? My phone gets grabbed out of my no hand. Yeah. Someone dashes down a side street. I start running after them going, I'm from a different country. I need it. Like mm. he's going to go, oh, oh I'm yeah. so sorry about it. We give it back. Sorry about that. But this other back, guy yeah. comes streaking past, grabs it back. They wrestle for my phone, grabs it back off him and gives it to me. Nice. Did, did he give him a punch as well? No, well, then the other guy came back with his mate and looked like they were going to have a punch, but then it all went away. That's a chivalrous mm. act right there. I know, I and I was like, that. dude, and hugged him. And yeah, so Chicago is a mixed bag. <laughs> <laughs> Even though you found get, out in like 10 seconds. It, it was like, great. my heart was going, <laughs> yeah, it was all pretty crazy. That's but a great story. I started running after him, like, like it's Chicago. He could have gone, <laughs> I was yeah, like, I'm Wonder Woman! Give yeah. it back! Anyway, <laughs> back to back, rugby. Back to the rugby. That was a great story, yeah. though. Back to the rugby. <laughs> um, for this weekend's game, uh, we also mm. have a couple of locks who are out. Retallick and Whitelock are out. And we've just heard that Luke Romano was, yeah. is heading home. So we might get a start for Scott Barrett. Yeah, he could get a start or via the feeders bench. over there as well. So one's going to start, one's going to be on the bench. Uh, massive opportunity for um, Auckland's uh, Patrick Tupelotu. He is such an impressive rugby player. I've got a lot of time for that boy, and uh, I think uh, that you will find him absolutely shining. The Irish have got three really key uh, forwards out as well. Uh, so I think all things being equal, I don't know if it's going to be one of those clinical, amazing performances that you've seen. Something about it slightly disruptive about their build-up. I know they're getting down to the hard work now. I'd love to see a typical clinical all-black display wiping the Irish, but I think it may be a little bit closer given it's neutral territory. I agree with everything that he just said, with all full knowledge of every person <laughs> that he just talked about. Well, if you are agreeing with that, then we should come to you first and you can give us a score. Uh, I'll give you a score. Yes. Well, against mm. Ireland, mm. Uh, I don't know, like 48-12. Uh, is that that's crazy? Not, that's, not, that's not bad. Hey. It's not bad. It's not bad. I, I, the island, and a 30. My, Scotland, my margin's probably more, yeah, I think I'm leaning towards maybe a 36 14, I think. Right. So 20.1? Yeah, about a 20. About a 20. And uh, before, we move, before we move off the rugby topic in general, Warren mm. Gatlin in the paper just this morning yes. talking about being embarrassed to be in New Zealand and the boorish nature of the uh, mm. Eden Park crowd booing. Oh, mm. booing Paul, Paul Warren, who's no. bringing the Lions yeah. team over next Paul Quaid year. Cooper. Cooper. I agree. I agree. Oh. Again, the, the whiny lady in the middle <laughs> is saying, I just get sick of it. I think that there's just nothing worse than a, a sore winner. Do you know what I mean? Like, you know, sore losers bad enough, but like when you when you trumpet over other people, Trump, yeah, but it's when you're winning. It's, it's become a thing though, especially know, it, with Quade Cooper. It's, it's called like Quade Cooper. Things. What did he ever do? Yeah, he represented Paul Quade his country. Oh, he did nothing. something, didn't he? What did he do? He attacked uh, Richie McCaw pretty viciously oh, on several occasions. Oh, brazen, disgraceful attack. Several occasions. Yeah, mm, yeah I'm okay. surprised Richie's still got a head yeah. after the uh, battering that he was given by yeah. uh, by Quade. But just that to constantly terrible. boo, and it's but it's not just him. It's like Australia. And my mother's Australian. I get so sick of the parochial. If we had have known that before we started today yeah, but just be nice 
don't you know like we're winning so just but you know happy. part of going to a live sports event is giving it to the opposition you don't have to be nasty well right? yeah don't have to boo oh but is booing really that nasty yes. you know someone's about to go and take a kick and you go boo I'm just going to hope you I'm miss it that's com right. come into news to it when you're on and just go <laughs> boo oh god oh what a softy oh soft boo 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 so if we go to your show it. at the Globe Theatre yeah at, yeah, I, I'm going to heckle you. I thought that we were yeah. we're not allowed to boo. No, you're not allowed to boo. Oh. Oh. Well, well, can't, if right? I pay for my ticket, I can bloody well do what I want. No, you can just you can walk out. That's fine. I prefer that to booing. Yeah. Really? Yeah, I do. But at least I'd still be you there. Stand up and give me a standing ovation. <laughs> <laughs> and then leave. That's what I Which is what will be happening at Soldier Field in Chicago this, when this the weekend. Right. 20. Wasn't or that a great segue? Yeah. Oh, I thought you were going to say we're in the Globe Theatre for Promise and Promise Beauty. Is that as well?